Hello, this is Evangelist Dr. Robert L. McKim Sr. from Carrollton, Ohio. Let me clarify something. I'm not wishing anybody dead. I'm just quoting scripture. But again, you wouldn't know scripture if it bit you in the butt. Matthew 24, Jesus says, Matthew 24, Jesus says, immediately after the tribulation of those days, not before the tribulation, immediately after the tribulation of those days, the sun will be darkened and the moon will not give off its light. The stars will fall from the heavens, or the heaven, and the powers of, he of the heavens will be shaken. Then the sign of the Son of Man will appear in heaven, and then all the tribes of the earth, all the tribes, or basically all the... Um, Nationalities, all the um, people, whether they're black, white, red, brown, or rainbow color, of the earth will mourn and they will see the Son of Man coming. They will see the Son of Man coming on the clouds of heaven with pow power and great glory. Now, the other scripture I wanted to read to you is in Luke. Luke. Luke 21. down here and there will be signs in the sun in the moon and in the stars and on the earth distress of nations with perplexity and the sea and the waves roaring men's hearts failing them from fear and expectation of the things which are coming on earth for the powers of heaven will be shaken men's hearts failing them from fear so just think if you already have a weak heart if you already have a weak heart That's what I'm saying. I'm not saying that because you do have a weak heart that I want you dead. And I know what you'll probably do. You'll probably take this video and edit this video like you think you have the right to do. But you know what? If you contact the authorities, they'll just see the actual video that I made and they'll know, wait a minute, these people are editing his videos, which they do not have the right to do, but they're doing it anyhow. So who should we go after? YouTube for allowing these terroristic YouTube channels that like to terrorize Christians, ministers, and Christian organizations since we don't know really who's behind this or these you know these channels but yeah I'm sure it, you know the ones that have already shown their their faces I'm sure the FBI can do a facial recognition and really find you 
if not the FBI, probably the National Security Agency. And Homeland Security. Because, you know, sooner or later, with everything that you're saying, it's going to come. It's going to come around. I'm not threatening anybody. I'm not really threatening anybody. And if you say, oh, well, he said he's going to do this and he's going to do that. And, and he did this and he did that in the past. And the world does not. And you're part of the world. Does not want people's uh, sins to, you know, be cast into the, the deepest part of the sea. You want them constantly brought up. And brought out. Well, I know my sins are covered by the blood of Jesus Christ. And they're cast into the, the sea of, uh, like, you know, in the deepest part of the sea. Where God no longer remembers them. God no longer remembers my sins. But again, you're not God, and you're not God-like. But yet you think you are God-like because you have the power to go on the internet and sign me up to uh, various uh, websites and, and newsletters and things of that nature without me going and physically myself clicking the link saying yes I want to sign up so either someone has a keylogger program on my computer somehow they're getting around my security features they even have getting around all my security features for my uh, email When are you just going to grow up and stop? Probably when the time God says, eh, It's time, Jesus. It's time, my son. Go and get my elect. God, have mercy on your souls. God bless you. Have a blessed day.